This is a story told to me by Ava Yates. Sweet Pea 27 is her YouTube channel. Ava's late son, Dan, owned a gold cross with a 16-inch gold chain. The cross had a hammered-out look to it. Dan was proud of this cross. When Dan was tragically murdered in 1994 at the age of 19, Rusty, his brother, wanted something to remember him by. He was given Dan's gold cross. Rusty wore this cross everywhere he went. Rusty played soccer at school and played in tournaments. At one of these tournaments on a rainy day, he finished his game and walked over to where his mother was watching the game. He told her that the cross fell off the chain during the game and he had no idea where. The field was very muddy and Rusty told his mother they would never find it. Rusty, understandably, was very upset. A little over a week later, Ava's daughter, Kitty, asked her to walk across the soccer field with her. This surprised Ava, as it was very late in the afternoon. As they walked out on the field, it came to Ava to make a cross as they walked. She walked from right to left, as where Jesus' arms would have been, and his heart in the middle. Then she walked to where his feet would have been. She then turned around and walked back up towards his head. Ava was praying the whole time, asking Jesus to bless them as they looked for the cross. Ava also asked Jesus to bless anyone else who might find this cross and to make it known to them that this cross belonged to someone very special and that they would appreciate it. Ava was humbly broken, asking Jesus to bless them, or anyone that might find this cross. Ava thought of the price of this cross and told God it was not the cost of it, but it was special to their hearts. As Ava neared the head of Jesus, she looked to her right and seen the bright, shiny cross that belonged to her son. Ava was so surprised she called her daughter to her side without taking her eyes off of it. She told her daughter, Look how it shines, and no mud on it. Ava gave praise to God as she picked up the cross for allowing them to find it. Ava wanted many to hear this story, so please share it. Dan's brother, Rusty, still wears this cross on special occasions. God bless you, my friends.